it. Ray Ferraro downstairs and Eddie Olchek upstairs. I'm Mike Emery. Tonight, we have an AHL matchup. Eddie, as we get ready for this, what's on your mind? The American Hockey League has a storied history and has seen lots of change over the years, but remains proud and competitive, which should inspire the players here tonight to leave it all on the ice. We are ready for the first face-off of the night. The Griffins get the first play of the game. Grand Rapids had a lot of things clicking in their last game, and it resulted in the win. Confidence is high coming into this one. Takes that pass. Here we go. Score! Boy, they're on the board early, aren't they? Sometimes when you score first, you take the edge off your own team. That can't happen. You're up one, go make it two. You always hope if you're paying the price of admission as a home fan that your team scores first. In this case, it has. So far, they got their money's worth early in this game. Laid on to Fur. Good place to shoot from. Waffle boarded. Pitching it to O'Brien. Let's the shot fly. That is a shot that went way wide. Doc, these are chances that keep you up at night. A shot from the slot and he misses by that much? Got to do way better than that. Around through the corner. Shot on goal. What a reaction save. He had his eye on the puck the whole time. What a stop. Puck loose now picked up. Oh, man, that'll bring a penalty. Look out, here it comes. Well, there's no surprise there, Doc. We expected a physical game. The contest will be aggressive from start to finish. There's an early hit to set the tone. Hershey's minor is for charging. Too many strides taken, Doc, while making contact. The Griffins will get their first power play crack of the game. Let's see how they do. Just because it's your power play doesn't mean you can take a nap here. You have to work hard and continue to generate chances. And the whistle and the trainer. Hopefully not a gurney on this one. Well, this is a dead end. He thinks there's room to go. There isn't, and he gets pumped. Under seven minutes gone. It's a 1-0 game. And the faceoff's won. Blue line control. Passed it ahead where there is some space. Score! A power play goal. And it's a biggie. He had that wrist shot ready to go in a perfect scoring area. Yeah, shooters love to beat the goaltender up over the glove side, don't they, Edzo? The butterfly position covers the bottom of the net. Doesn't help him much here, though. And that's a face-off win. Picks it up back there. Grand Rapids in mid-ice, skating along the side. Attack zone possession here. Shoots one. Grab! Johansson's headed to neutral ice. Cuts the pass. Grand Rapids' team play has forced another turnover in this tight game. It's all on his shoulders. Comes up big on the breakaway. Shoots one, right in that catching glove, good work. Goalies have to make a half a dozen great stops in a win. This is one on a beautiful move, but there is nowhere for the puck to go.
The puck's dropped, and that's a great job tying the man up on that faceoff. Takes it in from the neutral zone. Around to the corner. Routine save, but a necessary one. And yet another save. How does he do that? These saves are all about positioning. Oh, he'll take shots like that all night. Keep feeding him those muffins. He's going to stop every one of them. We go down to the benches. Here's Ray. The Griffins bench has a little more room on it. That injured player will not return tonight. That faceoff is one. From the outside. Oh, what a chance. What a save. Hershey's setting up an offense from the wing. Shoots one. Wonderful save. Grand Rapids carrying it up the wing. Feeds the point. And they've got it again. And they are in. He banks a pass ahead. Nudged along by the skate. Goes back deep for it. Slid the camper. And you thought open ice hitting was gone. Oh, that's going to make them think twice about going to that area. The Bears with a neutral zone possession along the way. Say. And snap the camper. He caught it and he holds on. 20 minutes are in the books. And so the coaches will have their say. The players will rest and listen. Two goals scored and both by the same team. Just a reminder to always keep your eye on the puck. It can enter the seating area and cause serious injury. Terry's goal advanced this for his team from a one-goal lead to a two as we head to break. Twenty minutes in the books, twenty minutes ahead. Edzo, what did you think of the first? The Bears are down in this game, Doc, and rightfully so. They did not manage the puck at all. If they want to get back in that game, they got to eliminate those turnovers. Period two is underway. Round it again. Gives it over to the point. Has that one measured in his own end. Passing one off now to O'Brien. A shot. The glove like lightning. Puck drop, tie up, and help from the winger. Steps across that line. It is a hooking call on this play. A restraining score! Three in a row! Well, the goaltender wants to be aggressive here, but this is just perfectly delivered. Grand Rapids has added to an enormous score. They are heavily out shooting the opponent, and we still have another entire period yet ahead of us. He's got that at center. Good, solid defensive play with the stick. Looking to O'Brien. Nice stand up poke check there. Steps in from the neutral zone. He chipped that one off the boards and ahead. Nearly grazed the iron on that. That was a dangerous chance, but unfortunately, we don't use soccer nets in hockey. Oh, what a hit that one was. Oh, he's been looking for that hit all night. Shot. Out. Goal post low. Loud clang. No goal. Takes that pass at center ice. 
Oh, and he misses. Wicked shot there. That's why I wasn't a goalie, Doc. You could almost count that one, but no. Grand Rapids has not given up much defensively at all. Their goaltender could play in a bathing suit and not get hurt down there. Puck controlled now by the defense. Skates it into the zone. Punched away. Hershey skating in their own end, trying to get to the neutral zone. Skilled play by Chelios. Grand Rapids is transporting the puck in the neutral zone. Flings it. Well done with that pass. And still another save. What a show. Got that pass near the blue line and now looks ahead. Big takeaway. Good hustle and the icing is waved off. Terrific glove save. Strong wrister. Save. Well, you know he's happy, guys. He's sitting there on the bench. He's got a couple of goals in his back pocket already. But you know he's thinking about number three. What an achievement that would be to bang in one more. A little under four minutes still to be skated. The scoring of the goal has made this now a three-goal lead. Will this become dangerous, though? Shoot. Use that big goalie stick well. Gains that offensive line. Fantastic shutdown. Chip to first. Nice save with the glove. The drama heightens in this final minute of the second period. That one hit him in the mask. Propelled to first. Shoots one. Save! Two periods are in the books here. And the books could very well have some perspiration stains on it by now because these teams have worked pretty hard. But still, a third period is ahead. Don't miss the chance to see the greatest talents in the world when they visit... Hershey's goaltender has had one of those nights. And so this score is lopsided. And we will return after he gets a rest and these words. Two periods played, one period ahead. What are your thoughts so far, Eddie? The Griffins have had their way offensively, putting up a bunch of goals here through the first two periods of play. Let's see how they play it the rest of the game. Do they sit back, or do they look to add to their comfortable lead? Oh, great cut! And in flight over the line. And the referee's whistle has stopped play. That's not really a scoring chance. It's a puck to the net. The goalie gets to handle it and stop it, but not a challenging stop at all. Scarbosa's lost another faceoff, and coincidentally, his team struggles. Crosses that line. Points it. On the outside, a shot. Puck ricocheted off the screen. A great wrist shot. Blocked. Just walking the tightrope. Takes that pass from the other point man. Wonderful stop. Grand Rapids has possession on the wing and neutral ice. Right in front. Great glove save. The goalie gave him the glove side, and he took it away. What a stop. As soon as the shooter starts to release this, the goalie drops to the butterfly. Hey, buddy, pick up your head. You might see he's down on his knees already. A little over six minutes have passed here in the third. There have been three goals in this game. They've all come from one team. Oh, what a glove he's got there. The Bears have it along the side at mid ice Give that goalie credit for another. That shot's a muffin. The goalie can stop that all day long.
defensive zone win. Grand Rapids controlling play now on their own end. Parked in the slot. Fires. That was a great play and goal. That was a tougher stop than a look. It's just him. Marvelous save. No time on that one. A wonderful save in the goal crease. Delayed penalty call. Who gets to advance the puck? Hershey's got two for boarding. This was a dangerous hit here, Doc. No chance for the player to protect himself. Anything you do once, you can do twice. Let's see if that applies to this particular power play. So much of a power play is confidence. When you have a little success, you feel like you can do it again. That's what they should feel after they've already pocketed one power play goal. The power play unit has to recoil and try yet again. Grand Rapids can't be loving the schedule that they were given at the start of this season. In order to have success through a tough season like this, a team needs to be firing on all cylinders as a single unit. Great teams win this race, Doc. Won that face off. Now what? But Sarister, strong shooter against a strong goaltender, and the guy with a trapper won. What a hit that was. I saw that one coming from a mile away. Great grab. Hangs on to that one for a stoppage in play. You can't run around looking for big hits like this. These come right into your lap. Good set up off the win. Cut that pass in his own end. Can start the attack going in the zone. You can almost count that one, but no, what a save. Grand Rapids on the move now at center. Good standing poke check. Right near the line. Alone. Outstanding save with a glove. Cuts that pass off. Fires! That shot hit a man. The Griffins haven't given up much here tonight. And when they have, their goaltender has been amazing. They're trying to protect this shadow all the way to the end. He takes that point pass. That puck was obstructed by a screen. Gains the zone. Went to the backhand. The pad flashed out to turn that aside. Hershey's good with that penalty kill, so we're back at full strength. And he steps in. Good pad stop. Grand Rapids will carry it through center ice. Takes a shot. Great bluff save, and he keeps it. A shot. Save. He scores! No, he doesn't. It's waved off. Maybe it was kicked in. They're going to go upstairs. Well, the referee had great position on the ice. Emphatically, he waved the goal off, but they're going to take a look upstairs. There's a bunch of murmuring through the building, Doc, while that review is going on. Now they're really upset. Face-off win, and now what will they do with it? A superb hit. A great hockey play there. Oh, that's a big hit, Doc, on a night where things haven't been going very well. He's doing whatever he can to get something positive for his team. That's a brilliant reception of a great long pass. Got that! Tremendous scoring chance. And so the final minute of the third and the tilt. This will all be done soon. That went off the path. He helps his team make progress with that bounce pass. Hey, safety never sleeps, boys. 
It looked like he was going to try and pass this right through his own goal crease, but he banked it off the boards to his partner. Walks the blue line. Outstanding body contact. One way to wear down your opponent, play physical. That's exactly what happened there. Oh, boy, what a hit. Sends to the point. Let's it rip. Wonderful save on a terrific scoring chance. The Bears have it in the defensive zone. job in the goal crease. First shutout victory of the year. Something all of these guys can build on. His teammates are congratulating him. He's looking to put a stamp on this season and he started that tonight. So that is it for this one. Thanks for watching. We hope you enjoyed it. For Eddie and Ray, Doc saying good night all.